our little friends over here. Look at our little friends. You just clean off their eyeballs. Their eyeballs are a little dirty, that's all. Their eyeballs are a little dirty, that's all. Hey, little friends. How you guys doing? How's everyone doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome. Welcome back to Cooking with Williams tonight. We're going to do a very simple meal. We kind of fast forwarded into the calendar. Um, tomorrow is sandwich day, but we may not be cooking tomorrow. We're not 100% sure. We have a full schedule again tomorrow. Tomorrow, we got a, a lot of events to go. Tomorrow, one of our programs that we're in, um, we're graduating. So, hearts and claps for us. We're graduating tomorrow. We're going to be. Uh huh. Tomorrow, we are doing our business. Yes, we are, babe. For B Force. That's our last one. No, 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 baby. We're thinking about the actual graduation ceremony, but it's our last. I guess I shouldn't say graduate, but we're, it's our last thing we have to do. And we have to do our business um, presentation. So we're going to be doing that tomorrow morning. Um, and not tomorrow. Why am I saying tomorrow morning? Oh, my gosh. I'm so confused with the schedule. It's just a lot of stuff going on. Tomorrow morning. That's next week that we're, we're graduating. So I just, yes. I'm sorry. Don't clap for us yet. Save it. Save it. Save it. Save it. Don't clap. You know? <laughs> we got to, we got to Wednesday. Shh. Don't, don't. Save it. Okay. But tomorrow, um, if you guys are in the area and you know that every year they have the um, Black Diamond weekend, we are going to be featured in their cooking with AI, with artificial intelligence. Um, presentation tomorrow morning. So tomorrow morning we're going to be making a meal um, with AI. So AI is going to have a chance to I think um, switch out some of our ingredients on our recipe. Uh, we're going to be making some small samples for about 100 to 150 people. So it's going to be a, it's going to be up there. It's going to be recorded. There's going to be cameras on the top, on the side, or whatever, and it's going to be shown later on. I don't know. We'll give you guys. Um, that information when we do have access to when it will be shown. So tomorrow morning, we're, we're getting up, dragging all of our stuff, our cooktops, our pots, our pans, our knives, and go ahead and do that. But they said it's too late. <laughs> a lot is going on, y'all. A lot is going on. So tomorrow we're doing that. And then a couple of days from then, we are going to be on Living 757. So we're going to be... Um, shooting that, I want to say the eighth. This is the same day, babe. Boy. Girl, we gotta look at our calendar. We gotta look at our calendar. Um, so anyhow, today we're gonna be making Monte Cristo sandwiches. Monte Cristo sandwiches. You guys will probably remember that name, like as the Count of Monte Cristo. He's a historical figure. Um, it is the sandwich that I, believe it or not, used to be in charge of making for the chain restaurants, Bennigan's. And they're probably, I think they're out of, I think they're out of um, business now. But I'm going to do a uh, Bennigan's Monte Cristo sandwich tonight. It's a very simple recipe. Um, it's a little... It's not like the traditional Monte Cristo sandwiches, so we're going to change it up a little bit and do it just like Benigan's does it. Um, but we'll, you'll see what it is. Very simple, and that'll be our sandwich day for yes for tomorrow, okay? So let's get started, guys. We're going to go ahead and do what we got to do. Good to have you all. I think Anita's going to be making us some fried potatoes and onions, so everything's going to be good. I already know it. Um, we're going to go ahead and start with our theme music. We're going to do our cleansing breath. And our word for the day, and let's get into this simple, simple recipe, all right? Good to have you all here. Good to see you all here. Please share. Sharon is Karen. I thank you for being there. Um, boom, boom, boom. And let's go. I don't know what was happening, y'all, but y'all can, can get this song here. <laughs> I'm 
There's a bet that is in Des Moines. Des Moines, Des Moines Iowa. Good. We're gonna show, I like other taste. We're showing you what you can prepare tomorrow for National Sandwich Day. We're showing you what you can prepare tomorrow. That's what we're doing. I like it. I like the bounce back on Okay, look who I just got. My breathing assistant. Hey, who just said, I ain't eating all that. She said, why can't he just make something regular like beans? I did not. I didn't say that. Mom's going to eat. Well, my mom says she needs some regular food. She wants some yeah, lima beans fancy. and spam. Okay, <laughs> Anyhow, you mom, you're going to do our cleanse. You're going to do our cleanse your breath, mom. Okay. So we're going to count to three. Go back. Oh, she said she's watching the movie, so she, she paused to come out here and breathe with you guys. So you also feel special. So we're going we're gonna to count to three. We're going to inhale some cleanse your breath. We're going to hold it for a second, mom. And then we're going to release, okay? Are you ready? Ready? Let's do it. One, two, three. Let's inhale, mom. Let's hold it for a second, and let's release. Let us drop the shoulders and shake it off. There you go. All right. So, this time we're going to go check out what the word for the day on the fridge. We're going to see what our pastor, G.E. Refrigerator said. Mom's going back to a movie. She said, that's enough. She said, that, that is enough. She said, that's enough for us. She already left us. Let me turn the camera around so we can... See what the word is on the fridge today. Oh, let me unplug this. Is this okay to unplug yeah. that? Okay. So, the word for today is not receiving what you deserve can trick you into believing you don't deserve it. Did you know that? Did you know that not receiving over and over and over what you deserve, whether it be relationships, finances, jobs, just just goals. If you don't receive it enough, it could trick you into believing, maybe, maybe I just don't deserve a good man, a good job, finances. Don't let it trick you, okay? Do not let it trick you. So that's the word for the day. If you feel it in your spirit, don't say amen. amen. I feel like y'all feel that. He said, Mom Green said, get somebody else to do it. Absolutely. So Anita, she like, ran back so fast. Look, she's gone, y'all. I know. Anita. She don't know how to pause. Oh, she don't know how to pause? Really? I can show her how to do that. Oh, my God. Poor Mom. She might have missed a little bit of story. So Anita's doing uh, a little bit of fried potatoes and onions. Because What's up, Jen Jones? Is that my cousin, Jen? How you doing, lady? I just I was just with your mom, um, Aunt Katie, today. Uh, so Anita's doing that, and I'm going to show you guys how to do a very simple Monte Cristo sandwich. If you haven't had them in years, there's a couple of ways to do it. It's usually a Monte Cristo sandwich. Usually, um, is turkey and ham and like a Swiss cheese usually, and then uh, you got a little egg and milk and some seasonings and you kind of dip the whole sandwich in that and then fry it in a frying pan I'm we're gonna sorry. do it for we're gonna do it the way that bennigan's used to do it the way i learned how to do it we're gonna do a bennigan style monte crystal sandwich so let's go on over here so we can start getting this thing together it's very it simple very it. it's very it's very easy it's very easy if you kind of like uh ham and and cheese and turkey it's just a little elevated ham and cheese and turkey, all right? Let me get this out of the way. And we are going to start getting our ingredients together. So, welcome, 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 welcome. First thing we're going to do is we're going to get our batter together. Guess what you can do if you feel like doing it. If you don't want to go all these steps and you have some pancake mix in your house, a little Sprite or salsa water, put that together and dip it in that. But we're gonna make it from scratch, so I'm gonna show you all the ingredients, all right? So, first thing we're gonna use is one egg and some water. One to one quarter cup, because it depends on how thick you want the batter. You might want it a little more runny, you might want it a little thicker. 
Um, so what I'm going to do here is get my whisk, and we're going to start getting this together. Guess what, y'all? The recipe is on the website. So you don't have to remember this or, you know, try to write it down while I'm saying it. Good. Good to see everyone. Y'all, this is a jumbo egg. They call this a jumbo egg. It's whatever. We're going to do what we got. So we're going to go ahead and get a little crack on there. Get a little whisk in our bowl. And then we're going to get our water. I'm going to put about a cup and leave about a quarter of a cup. Just to see how it feels. I'll, I'll add more if I need to. But mix that water and the egg together. Hope you can see that. And we're going to start adding our other ingredients. What's the other ingredients there? Well, I'm glad you asked. We're going to add some flour, about a cup and a half of flour. This is going to be a wet batter. You can save this batter. Oh, you, can, nah, you probably shouldn't save it. But you can use it for like deep fried Twinkies or Oreos or anything like that that you want that type of batter with, okay? I can't tell you what to do. And maybe I will. Look, I got some Oreos, so don't. What? 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 I'm, I'm just saying. Don't, dessert? Don't, don't think we ain't going to come up with it. We might be coming up with dessert, babe. We're going to be like a whole carnival food place. All right, okay. All right, and what are we going to use in here? So since we're using, we're doing the flour, we're doing a nice batter, we're going to add some baking powder in here. Measurements are on the website. We'll get that a nice whisk because we want it to be fluffy and crispy. We're going to add some sugar. And instead of just salt, I decided to add our seasoning blend so we can add a little more flavor in that. So we, we're getting salt and onion and garlic and things like that. So we're adding our, our pink Himalayan seasoning blend in here. And I think I like it this consistency. I don't want it too runny. It's not bad. And this is going to coat our sandwich. Now, to do a perfect Monte Cristo, and this is what we used to do it in Bennigan's, was we prepped ahead of time. So what we did was we made our sandwich and Goonie, yes, we do make Italian food like pasta and lasagna. I just made some pasta last week from scratch and recipes are on our website. Um, take the sandwich, smash it together, believe it or not, smash it together because it so won't fall apart when you cut it. And then we wrap it, put toothpicks in it, wrap it with um, like a saran wrap type thing and throw it in the fridge till the next day. So. We always prep the day before for the Monte Cristo sandwiches. Did we do it today? We're going to go ahead and do that. But I ha but we're going to show you how to do it, and it'll be fine. It'll be fine. So, good to see you all. Let's start getting our sandwiches together. So we're going to use this Pepper's Farm, farmhouse potato bread. And for each sandwich, you need about three pieces of bread. You know what else we're going to do, too? <clears throat> Sometimes these sandwiches have nothing on it but the cheese and the meat, okay? Um, but if you want to add a little flavor, I would add, like, um, a stone ground mustard, a Dijon mustard. Today, I'm going to make a honey mustard, all right? So we're just going to slide, slide a little of that honey mustard onto the bread. And I think I'm just going to put it on the middle piece of bread. But let's, let's stop talking about it and be about it, all right? Let me grab something to make a little quick honey mustard here. So I've got a little, my little container. I'm going to grab, uh, what are we going to do, Derek? We're going to do stone ground. Yeah, we'll do, we'll do a little stone ground honey mustard. So we're going to add a little stone ground here. Ground is on. I got a little flash in it. A little flash in here. We'll probably make about three sandwiches. Daryl think he's coming by, right? You said it. He said he was. Okay. Little.
stone ground mustard. We'll add a little bit of honey to that. A little bit of honey there. spread for a sandwich. What's up, Joyce? Good to see you all. Okay, okay. Add an egg on top. Okay. So a nice little savory mustard. I'm, I'm just going to get a, a surface to put the bread on. That's okay. Thank you, babe. All right, let's start assembling these sandwiches. Okay, so we don't eat y'all. We're using deli meat, guys. So I got a, some thin sliced deli meat right before um, I got home today. I'll take this bread out. So this is potato bread you can use if you want. You want a more bready uh, sandwich? Use some Texas toast. I can't tell you what to do. Really? I know one thing. Ooh. Lord, do we have some more bread somewhere? Got heal. Got a heal on one of them. What's Jesus, on Jesus heal them. We didn't buy bread. I thought we had bread. I thought I asked you like 14 times in the store. I, said, I didn't know that had been opened. Where is that? I think I'll make more than uh. I'll make one more. Yep. I thought I heard Gail. No, that was me. Oh. That was me. So. We got our bread here, guys. And we're going to start assembling this bad boy. Assembling it. I think I heard him outside the door. Okay. He picked up the phone. Yes. So and what's going on, on, sir? Not the first one. <laughs> All right, so we got some honey ham deli meat here. We've got some all natural turkey. We have some provolone. You can use Swiss. Swiss is, is, is the uh, authentic way to do it. But I also put some American on there too. Okay. <clears throat> so what we're gonna do is take apart our sandwich. We have three pieces. And I'm gonna take out the middle piece from each. Boop, boop, boop. And we start putting together the sandwich. So, First thing I'm gonna do is go with the turkey. I said go with the ham first. Oh, just go around the way down first. We say on? Yeah. I'm gonna put the mustard in the middle. Okay. Want some cheese and stuff. So I'm gonna get about. Hi, boo -boo. Hey, what's up, buddy. son? How you doing? You doing all right? We gonna get about two to three slices of each meat. So I'm gonna see grab. This. Hmm? I gotta see this. You gotta one. see this one. You need to record it. You this never one. had a Monte Cristo? No, I'm not. I mean, I'm culture, but not that kind of culture. <laughs> All right, we're gonna pick ham, around, and we're gonna put with the ham our provolone. Or the other way around, it really doesn't matter. It's all gonna get eaten together. I feel like in my spirit, two pieces of cheese. So we got our ham and our cheese in here. On the other side, let me do a, let me do a couple of them so I have to do them one at a time. How about that? We're gonna do a ham and cheese, ham and cheese, ham and cheese. All right. Okay. So wait, so you're doing the American cheese? Uh huh. What are you doing one? with that? We're gonna do provolone on the other side. Mm -hmm. um, traditionally, it's usually like uh, Swiss. Mm. I've seen it with Swiss and American too. Two pieces of cheese. Okay, different. Um, normally, when we, we used to make this in uh, Dennegan's, we prep it. The I day remember before. Dennegan's, yeah. yeah. We prep it the day before. And you know what? I used to make these. And you know what else I used to make? The Death by Chocolate. Yeah. You ever had those before? I don't like chocolate cake like I that. I was a prep, like, I was a prep chef. Like, mm -mm. I love way, chocolate. Way, Women way, don't way, like way, chocolate way cake. Way back in the day. Way back in the day. I was like a young. Y'all was little. Like, y'all were like. 
I remember Bennigan's, but I don't remember his sandwich, bro. I probably remember Bennigan's because I probably got some kind of discount for the family over. I remember going there, it was green. I don't remember the food meal like that, though. Mm-hmm. I just remember to put the establishment. Get my probe in there, guys. Boom. There we go. Now I'm going to do the turkey. Where I get this watch, this watch is from Invicta.com. Invicta. No watch. No, we don't sponsor our shit. Ah. Well, there you go. Hold that up. All right. And I had this cut thin, so I'm probably, it's probably going to all break up because it's turkey. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, 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 yep. So, y'all have on top of it? Mm hmm. Goes on this one, baby. I'm going to put this on this side. You just chop it up. Yeah, we can chop it all up. It's actually going to come apart like this, so it's whatever. So we're going to get the turkey on the other side. That tablet will say like so, like that. Get our turkey meat over here. Put it in your mouth. Mm-hmm. All right, and on this side, we're going to be putting... American cheese. Okay. Why? Because we can. It's gonna melt. You don't have to use American cheese if you're just so so anti-American cheese. Or American. No, American. Or American. I like that mild cheddar better than American. You can though. use a cheddar. You can use any other type a of cheese. Colby. These are just cheese. Pepper Jack. Use. A Colby. Pepper Jack. Yeah. Colby. That's not uh, traditionally what they use, but you can. I like that little spice in my life. You might want a little bit of spice there. Or use that um that steakhouse onion cheese. That yeah, that's really, I like that one. Mm-hmm. So we're going to go ahead and get that together. Now, now we're going to deal with the middle bun. And what we're going to do with this middle mm-hmm. bun is hit it up with our that's mustard, mustard, our honey mustard that we did on both sides. Oh, I thought that was that stone mustard. That's what it is a stone mm-hmm. meal honey mustard we just okay. made. We just made it while you were while you were outside goofing around, don't you? Yeah, I was talking to the neighbor. <laughs> she, said, she was just like, um, I think that's just her Daryl. I say, I think it's outside. Grandma said that. Yeah, I saw this one of the neighbors. So we're gonna get that on both sides. I'm gonna let that down here. So you don't want to line them up. Boom, boom, boom. And then we go. I did. I, I did not. Oh, I did not line it up. Sorry. No. OCD good. Good. Kicked in for a it did. I was, it would have messed me up too. And you just want to press it down, and then you want to hit it up with. I had it sitting right here. What? A spatula. My toothpicks. Right here. Oh, over here. Move it over. Okay. Put them over here. Okay. And you want to toothpick all your corners to hold it through. Again, if you're doing this ahead of time, it's gonna come out a lot better. Um, let it sit in the fridge. Like overnight, really wrap them up, press them down, and wrap them with, with Cool Whip. With cool whip. <laughs> <laughs> That's nasty. <laughs> wrap That's them up nasty. with Cool Whip if you feel like it. That's up to you. It's up to you. I eat that. Um, <laughs> or don't. Or don't, which is probably better. We're going to do the same thing on the all these three. That's potato bread? This is potato bread, babe. Son, you still, you still my baby. You're an old baby, but you still want to be. <laughs> Both sides? Okay. Both sides. Yeah, you don't have to. You can do it on all four if you want. But I figured mm-hmm. that's going to be a little too overpowered. Yeah, who a was that? Bit. We're going to have all the flavors on both, okay? And look, Daryl, the heel. Yes, sorry. Well, hey, you're fixing. You that one's going to be good. Now, what I did for the magic of uh, television was I took one and I put it in the fridge about an hour ago. Oh, Daryl, you just stopped our uh, live. I did? Yes, sir. Which one? Oh, tap the mic. Resume. We got and two. You got to do it? Yeah. I was wondering why it was crooked like that at first. Got one, guys, that we put in earlier. It didn't, it didn't, it didn't sit long enough, but it'll be... A little more put together, so we're gonna just go ahead and get that. Can I have batter powder? Batter, yeah. I said I'm just gonna, I'm just dipping it. 
boom. And we'll get that honey mustard on both sides. Um, MVP, I believe so. What's what that? you believe? The raspberry sauce? Yes. Yeah, we have some. We have that. that. How you doing, Quadera? And powdered sugar. Quadera Adore, how you doing? I like that name. Sounds like all that dishes from dishwasher. Um, uh, somebody said something about, I thought it was National Sandwich Day. No, no today's that's not, tomorrow. that's tomorrow. Today is National, um, An Heavenly Eggs. Angel Eggs. Yeah, Angel Eggs. Eggs. What? I'm about to make me a day. Make me some day. Why? Exactly. Just because. Okay. To get my petition together. There right. we go. So, got that together. Let's show you how to get this done. Let's get some grease going. Um, Let's get some grease on. How you doing, Mr. You can do this in a more shallow pan if you want to. We'll just flip it, flip it, flip it. But I'm going to try to get a little bit of deep fry going in there. And, okay. and LaVon Sanders, have a good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Ain't that how they say it? Yeah, I'm playing over here. I'm playing over here in the front. You can do it right here. Okay. Yeah, you just it up. Um, Bless 80 Grander, how you doing? And MVP, I got you. I'm proud that they did it already. And how you doing, Miss Dita? And I got two, two on IG. What's good with you? And Brown, happy early birthday. You'll be 60 tomorrow. Awesome. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Hey, Kimberly Wolf, how you doing? Delicious. Delicious. <laughs> um, Valerie delicious. Young, how are you doing this evening, Ooh, Valerie? Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. Now I want some egg for Young looking at that walk like that. All right, let's start getting our stuff going here. Mm -hmm. gonna, and this is our sandwich that kind of set for about an hour. It didn't set long enough. But what will happen is that moisture will kind of like hold everything together a little better. Okay. Wrapped it up. Show you how to. Finish these bad boys off, and he was probably almost done with these. He was well, good. Hey, how you doing, Lakeisha? I see. Finish that off with some. How you doing, Allison? And Evelyn, you missed the order today. Sorry, Evelyn. Close Um, doing Desi. How you doing, doing? Hey, seeing a lady bug. How you doing? And Daisy Thomas. Glad you have him. have you here with us, Daisy. Powdered sugar, okay. Uh huh. What is that? Get it with a little powder. Ada sugar. Jane, how you that's doing, Ada? You to make it happen, Daryl. About to find out. Byron Rogers is good with you. We're just trying to find out, baby. Just wait for it to get hot. Uh huh. What temperature you wanted at? Like three fifty. Okay. Yeah. Like three fifty. These uh -huh. are good because they get they get hot. How you doing, Nancy Hayward? They get, they get hot pretty fast. Lydia Hardy, how you doing, sweetheart? Dion, I see you too. Got Dion, Look at that. Donna, hey, Patricia, Kim, I see y'all. How you doing, Diana? That. That's all. Okay, you almost there. Happy birthday. And Nancy Hayward, I'm fine as always. I can't help it. It's just being me. Hey, Tammy Cooper, how you doing? And thank you, MVP. That wrist work, that wrist work. Uh, yeah, how you doing, moves. Monica? Let me, show, let me show what's going on in the pan real quick. Uh, Yes, you too. Let me bring you over too. Yes, bro. Yes, taters. You better start tatering. That's what we do with the garlic black pepper. With the garlic black pepper. And no salt go to and the spicy seafood blend. There we go. Now we just wait. 
Tiffany Washington. How are you, Miss Washington? Donna Shepard, how are you doing this evening? Hello, Marcia Hill. How are you in the household doing? You in a whole household. The whole household. Everybody doing. Everybody doing. Hey, Betty Lumpkins. Hey. Who right, is this? Maria Renee Lopez. How you doing, Miss Lopez? And Brian, you're so welcome, sweetheart. You're so welcome. And enjoy your 60th birthday. Who is that? Cage Bob. <laughs> okay, what's up, Cage Bob? And my name is 1954. Is that a good is that a good year? 1954? And BP just be you missed the potatoes. She just showed the potatoes. You missed yeah, it. What's wrong with your little lady? Yeah, you missed it. Um, Lisa, you can either order online or you can wait till this is over with, and we'll take your order over the phone. Whichever one's more convenient for you. But if I was you, I'd order online as soon as possible. Um, Edith Robinson, no dessert tonight. You chocolate enough for Hey, maybe hey, we have enough. Yeah, we have yeah, enough yeah, battery. Yeah. Might, yeah. might be fried See, a couple of oil. I'm, not hot. <laughs> I'm just saying we got hot. Uh, we got hot oil. Yeah. <laughs> the oil's still hot. I'm just saying. Um, Selena Hyatt, how you doing? Hyatt, huh? Like the hotel, right? I'm trying sure. to say what's up. Can Give me an executive out. manager over there. Absolutely. It's gonna be good, y'all. And Nancy here, what I love your mother. I love her too. She's the realest. I know. Somebody had salmon last night. Hold up. Ooh, you know what good. you should make though? One well, of y'all should make some salmon egg rolls. What one of y'all should make? Yeah, we did that in a while. Two thirty, getting there, y'all. The first one is gonna be this. So <laughs> BP just be yes. My dad walked the camera over there and showed y'all a beautiful uh -huh, potato. It, they look so delectable right now. You was over there playing on somebody else's live BP and not paying us no attention. The white Morris from Kingston, Jamaica. Whoa. That's what I'm talking about. I need to go back to Jamaica. What you say? Ivy. Yeah, yeah, I, I never like those. I love it. What I, Rochelle, what you making for the husband? You making something for the husband? That's what I'm talking about, Rochelle. And Selena, you wish? I wish you was too, Selena. We be besties. True. I wish you was too. Okay, bestie. Hey, you doing, Lisa Knowles? I'm waiting for your single to come out, Lisa. I'm waiting for it. Let me know. I'm trying to hear it. So kind of like, a, kind of keeps it together a little better. See how that is? That's, that's you could set it. it. If it was overnight, it'd be like perfect. Okay. You probably wouldn't even need the two plus as much. Frida Allen, how are you, beautiful? Hi, What's up, My Frida? island woman, the island gal. How you doing? Sherry, Sherry, don't start Sherry Wilson. Do not start. So Texas Rangers won the World Series. Your team I'm won. <laughs> I know you're trying to take my team. <laughs> Already not my team. Right. I think one of these ones. How are you seven, doing, Gene Washington? Toothpicks in. That help them set better? Bro, I, okay. I, I don't need to fall apart. That's all I'm saying. Um, Cheryl, what's that? Shirley Rebeltini from Garnerville, Nevada. Have I been to Garnerville, Nevada? No, I haven't. Really I've been to Nevada? Fallon, Nevada. And I've been to, um, what's that? Uh, Reno, Nevada. Reno, Nevada. <laughs> Been you been to Las Vegas? Yeah, I've been to Vegas. I've been to I Vegas. hated Reno though. Not Reno, um Fallon. I hated it. They had that what is it called? Hard water? So for like the water for like mud or the whatever. Beast there or something? Yeah. I, yeah. It's a base there now? Yeah, I was out, out there training. Do like um bombing runs and stuff out there. You training. need more in this one? I'm sorry, baby. You need more two picks in this one? Who is that? Curlin? See, it's a whole better. 
Hey, uh, Shirley E. That's Smith. why you put it in the fridge. That's why they eat it. Let me push them down some more. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. Yeah, it should be, I guess it would be all right. I'm just, hey, uh, Patsy uh, LaFleur. I like your, love your last name, LaFleur. La mm hmm the flowers, like, Patsy. Like the you flower. gotta say that while you were in the ass, Scott. Your chest gotta be up. La Flor. La Patsy, the flower. La flower. Mm -hmm. I'm not wearing my ass out of my pea coat. Now that I think about it, it's a, look, it's I seen uh, a thing last night. It said, it, I mean today. Did I see it today? It said, oh snap. It's R&B jacket weather. <laughs> you <laughs> stupid. On yeah. the guy, he said, <laughs> I miss he my said, Sherlin oh. though. <laughs> it ain't cold enough for that out here, though. That yeah, sure was. Not cool. normally, it's not. I mean, cold it really is. Yet. It really is that well. You know, back in the nineties, we yeah, right? <laughs> Who was that? Tonya Stephens. How you doing? I see my purple heart. Who gave him to me? Was that you, Miss Cox? Hold on, Joyce. Hey, Joyce A. Cox. How you doing? Three times out there. I'm gonna start dipping. Uh oh. Let's start dipping, guys. I see you, Donna Shepard and Victory Center. Oh, How you doing? We did. We did. <laughs> Mm. That G Dub, what's up with you, G Dub? And now you doing Nancy Lowe? How you doing? I got an Edna Ford, nineteen sixty four. That was a good Ford back then. Nineteen sixty four Ford. Heard it was good back then. Susie, what you know about the Ranger, Susie? I got a I got a Monica Low on Facebook and I got a Nancy Low on IG. Y'all related? They got the same last name. Y'all related? Hey, Laney Lane, how you doing? My test piece. Okay, he threw the whole thing in there. Y'all like a big old cake. Oh, James Monger about to have fun by himself. Oh, James Monger, you got a ticket. And I think Alisa French McKay might be joining us too. Wait a minute. No, she's Lisa Okay, McKay. no, I see the whole thing because it came up right behind the other person. Like, wait a minute. Lisa, uh, okay, I Alisa. I I Thank you, MVP. How you doing, Felicia? Felicia Bush. I know you was joking your name a whole lot, Felicia, Wednesday when that Friday came out. You probably still get it, don't you? I literally just cook this until the batter's done. Gonna so melt the cheese a bit. Mm -hmm. No, I'm sorry, Lisa. They're not gonna block you, Elisa. She said no! Right? <laughs> don't block me. Nah, you're good, Elisa. I do apologize, Elisa. I apologize. Who is this? 62 Lady K. How you doing, 62? I got a Blanche Spencer on YouTube. How you doing, Miss Spencer? So, yeah, that, this will keep putting it, doing it the day before will definitely um, allow it to stay together a little better. Mm -hmm. This is the one that I just put up. Take, I just put it in there an hour ahead of time. So, you kind of can see. What's going on now? I'm gonna try now. We're gonna try the other ones and see if we can see a difference. If they try to fall apart on us, we don't want that. But yeah. I'm gonna see. Who else in here? Hey, Deborah Levesque. And this one, I put a lot less cheese in it too. I put like half the cheese. Before you two. Okay, before you two. And Janine Hatcher was good with you, Cuzzo. What up, J9? Man, they making it to Tennessee. Yeah, how's Tennessee going? I hope good. Hope it ain't too cold over there. Oh man, I think a little water went in there from here. It's okay. Yo, stop playing for real. Hold on. Hey, Dion McDowell, I see you. Hold on, where'd she go? She just said the real Felicia moved to her name. Dang it, where'd it go? Okay, Mar Williams said, no joke, the real Felicia from Friday just moved to my small town. Oh. It's a Hoka, Texas. Recently, she's opening a vegan restaurant here. Yeah, I heard she's like real wow. vegan. Oh, yeah, she's funny. really big in the vegan, um, the vegan um, yeah. community, yeah. So you want to cook this till it's like a golden honey brown like that. Okay. And then we're going to go ahead and take this one out because really we're just... 
But Sonya Taylor, you had a Monty Crisco sandwich before? I've never heard of it. Like, I never heard of it. But then I was like, what? I was like, nah, I ain't heard of it. He was like, you know, I raised, I, I felt as a father because I didn't give you a Monty Crisco yeah, sandwich. Yeah, right. <laughs> didn't make you no Monty Crisco sandwiches when you were a kid. I'm sorry. Will you ever forgive me, son? I'll forgive you, sir. I'll forgive thank you. Thank you, man. Thank you. Yeah, it was like 34 this morning when I came out the house. It was like 34 degrees. I'm trying to cry like the, the, the ugly cry like the dad. And Lisa Watkins. Oh, she is? Before you two. Okay, got you. So y'all both got great taste because y'all here with us today. Well, Deborah Ferguson, we gonna learn today, Miss Ferguson. How you doing, Jack and Ellis? And Miss Sabrina, have a good evening, sweetheart. Hi, Sabrina. Who is that? Angel No Hall. Angel No Halo. I'm sorry, Angel No Halo. I like that. <laughs> I like it too. Angel No Halo. Will you leave your halo wet? That's the question. I could see your halo, halo, halo. And Janae Davis, when he told me what it was, I was like, hmm, okay. I mean, I'll, I'll try sandwich, most things with no problem. I'll it's try most things. Sandwich. It just I sounds like this. Don't do them anymore. It's just the contrast on the word to me at first. Like, or hmm. they'll, they'll do it. Not, they, they don't do it like this with the deep fry kind of mm -hmm. thing. Um, what they'll do is they'll do like a, almost like a um, a uh, French toast custardy kind of thing. Get the bread like that, and then they'll do it on, on the uh, stove. Fry mm -hmm. the bread, okay. fry it on the sides, go serve it like that. But it's usually always served with raspberry jam and uh, powdered sugar. Um, Angel No Halo, I like it too. It's interesting. I like it. It definitely struck my curiosity. Definitely. What did her name? Angel No Halo. I like it. That's when I would definitely speak to just to see, see, you know, pick her brand a little bit. That bad looks good. Hey, Chef Lou Twenty Two was good. That's why I don't think I'm gonna have enough. I might be able to do like one or two Oreos. Oh. Joshua Jenza, I don't remember what's in this sandwich. It was turkey. Provolone, like a, uh, ham, pumpkin. American cheese, honey stone mustard, um, pancake batter, deep fried. All right, you got, I think you got that. Did you say turkey? I said turkey. Okay. I need you just let it <laughs> Josh said, bit. Miller, you kind of got a point. It's a pancake, a pancake with a sandwich inside. You got a point. Uh -huh. pretty, pretty much. Mm -hmm. Pretty much is what it is. The way it's normally done, yeah. This is the way it's normally done. And I got a margarita, manianda. How you Maybe doing, margarita? Huh? Maybe I made I made three. I was only gonna make two, but I uh, can eat that thing with a knife and fork. Daryl's gonna take one with him. Uh, you know how you know you must not know Daryl. Are you new to Daryl? Hey, Betty Lumpkins. Oh, see so you know about this two Betty Lumpkins? Okay, y'all cultured over there. I'm the one that's not sir? cultured. No, I'm just gonna let you. It's just drink. Roderick, oh, what's good with you, Roderick? Mm -hmm. oh, so like... You said you're having a grilled cheese sandwich tonight with the little paprika sprinkles on the cheese. Okay, okay. Why don't you be fancy? Get you a salmon grilled cheese sandwich. Be fancy with it, Roderick. I know. Look salmon at us. grilled cheese. Look at us. Yeah, just a How you doing, Miss Purple? To you. Make you one. Okay. Don't make you one. I don't make you one, Mom. Mine came out specifically. So you want a regular sandwich or one over there? And Kawanza Kingdom. Well, I've had a Cuba one. style before. I had a Cuba style sandwich. I need to go to Cuba. Actually, that's one of my list to go to Cuba. What's a regular Cuba sandwich? Cuba and right Colombia. She don't want that mustard on there. Hey, Edith mustard. Robertson. Yolanda Ben, that's pan well, pancake batter, right? No. What is it? It's just uh, flour. It's a batter I made. It's a batter he made. It's proprietary. I say all that, uh, girl. The only show Blizz Liz. Okay, okay. They got some creative names on IG, boy. That's what they're going to have. Um, Lee Ann Fitzgerald, a Monte Cristo sandwich. If you don't know, I don't know, so we both uncultured because we don't know what uh, it is. We about to learn today, though. You ate sausage, baked beans, and a potato? 
Okay. Yeah, we ain't fancy apparently. We ain't something. <laughs> I'm learning today. You got a battle left or no? Huh? You got a battle left. <laughs> that makes sense real quick. It's proprietary batter. <laughs> hey, Kimberly Eastside, how you doing, love? You got enough to make one of each for you, for us. I'm um, Pamela Gray with vegetable oil, I believe. Yes, vegetable oil. No frills, vegetable oil. Whiskey. <laughs> We're gonna turn out some good old whiskey. Oh, a Cuban style Monte Cristo. Hmm, I could see that. That that probably good with a little pickle on there. I go for it. And Tamara Dozer, yes, it's powdered sugar and um, raspberry um, jam or whatever it was that they making. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not making the jam. I just bought some. <laughs> oh, there you go. You know, I usually make my sauces and stuff, but not today. Tonya Lindsay, that baked that got baked spaghetti. That's what I'm talking about. Baked spaghetti? Yeah. What the heck is baked spaghetti? Lasagna You've spaghetti never had juice. baked spaghetti? No. <laughs> Your face, though. <laughs> <laughs> and who is that? Jerry Francis Roger from Louisiana. Hey, cousin. Oh, you love Monte Crisco sandwiches? How all y'all hear about Monte Crisco and I never heard of it? You got you don't got you didn't get out as much as they did. I guess I didn't. Okay, Kia Baker, I don't feel bad. She never heard of it either. Okay, I ain't alone no more. I feel better now. Who is that? Chalk Lily? Okay, Chalk Lily. Welcome, welcome over here on IG. So y'all are sharing though, right? Because I don't see nobody saying they share nothing. Hey, Shani Davis, you love baked spaghetti? That's what I'm talking about. Are you going to help me out with the laughter? <laughs> it is interesting, right? I've never seen this before, and I'm actually intrigued. Boom, 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 Are you either Rhonda or Kimberly? Okay, I'm not alone no more. A couple of y'all never had it before. Yeah, right? Hey, Miss Vegan Beats, what's going on with you? You late. We already said Ben against you late, Miss Vegan Beats. You late. Better get you to make those. Yes, I did. Guess who was the guy who made them? Mm -hmm. And Melissa Wheeler. A million years ago. Cheddar's, Cheddar's had it too? I've never had a Cheddar's before. Cheddar's I've seen like it. Sonics, I've never right? had it before. No. Is it? Cheddar's? I've, I've, I've seen a Cheddar's before. Checkers. I'm thinking Cheddar's. Now, Cheddar's and um, Hardy's are the same thing. Really? Yeah, they probably do the same thing. Well, it, uh, I thought just, checkers and rallies was like the same thing. Yes, rallies are checkers and rallies, yeah. Rallies. They're the same thing pretty much. Just North and South kind of do. And Victoria made baked seafood spaghetti on Tuesday. Okay, well, that's fancy. Yeah. That's fancy. Okay. Linda McNair, you like baked spaghetti too? Okay. AZ Kitty 917. Who need a prayer tonight? That what you seen to need a prayer tonight. Yeah, see, I've seen cheddars, never ate at cheddars before. See, they have delicious, delicious crescent rolls. Never had it. I believe you. I believe you. All right, all right, let's do this. All right. Yep, you got some deep fried Oreos too. Got a little dessert going on here. I like the deep fried Snickers, though. They're pretty good. All right. This oh, is the I, I was thinking that, too. And no, a broccoli too casserole. Trash. I've never had a broccoli casserole before. A broccoli casserole? Yeah. I never had that before. Oh, Michelle Fancy. She had pepperoni. So her baked spaghetti. Okay, Michelle. Okay, okay Michelle. Still, still do what you got to do, boo -boo. Okay, Ms. GKB said cheddar has a good bourbon salmon. I I'm going to have to look up a cheddar see if you want to ride her somewhere. Has a good what salmon? A bourbon salmon. Oh. That pretty face. What you doing, pretty face? Because I was enjoying this beautiful culinary art going on right here. <laughs> Carnival food. Mm -hmm. <laughs> pretty <laughs> much. Are your brother pretty much for um, Benny Hanna? Okay. 
So you mean to tell me you had a Monte Cristo sandwich where you had no bag on deep fried Oreos? Where's she go? I just missed her name. I'm about to rub in just a little bit. Where's she go? You need the uh, serrated knife? Oh, good. I'm going to try to see if I can cut it with this cake. Yeah, baby Lumpkins. So like, is it going to melt the icing on the inside? Nope, you're going to have to wait and find out. Well, usually it's like the one with the... We're going to melt this a little bit. What do I do with my oil? I freeze my oil when I'm getting rid of it. I freeze it and then get rid of it. I don't just throw it away while it's still in the liquid form. You can actually cook a little cornstarch in it. And it will clean your... Yeah, it will clean it up for you. Put a little cornstarch in it, let it cook. It's gonna take all the impurities out, and we're gonna have clear <coughs> soil. Yeah. I may try that. I didn't think of some baking soda. I need to get some baking soda on the way home. I just thought about that. What you making? Some air fryer wings. You need baking soda for that? I'm gonna put baking soda, baking powder, some flour and seasonings. Cause I'm, I'm not, I can't cold like I normally would for deep frying. <coughs> so. Just I'm going to take the chicken, okay. score it, season it, let it sit, bring it out, egg wash it, flour it, spray it down, egg wash it, flour spray it down again, and throw in the air fryer for like 15 minutes at 400. All right, let's, let's see. see how it come out. Hey, them Bernadette T artists. And then VP, no that's a good idea. That's what I do with mine. What's that? Freeze it, then throw it in the old drawer old container and throw it in the trash. You do that. Or I put it back in the old container it came in. <laughs> Sharon Jones, really? Huh? You said toothpicks in that one. Oh, yeah, I still see a toothpick, yeah. So I got that toothpick out. I think I got them all out. Who was that? Patricia? How you doing, Patricia? Patricia Welch? Oh, the soft Don't hear that crunch. Hey, Rosemary Jimenez, how you doing this fine yeah, evening? Well, I see you. Yo, Nikita, that's dirty, yo. <laughs> that's dirty, Nikita. Who made some tea cakes today? Are they small or are they made out of tea? Or you just have them with tea? Oh. Dion, you went to Bennigan's too, Dion? See, I I remember Bennigan's. I remember going there, but I remember eating from there, though. You did. Who is that? Sweet Bibbles. Okay, you doing Sweet Bibbles? Sandwiches galore. All right. Sandwiches for days. How you doing, Yolanda Cunningham? Actually, I put this on first. It's just like looking at the contrast of flavors and stuff going on. It's like, huh? <laughs> Either this is really, really fat. Or with some like royalty meal that they was making that commoners couldn't have. Did that melt? What's that? Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what it looked like to me. Like either commoners couldn't have it and royalty made it, or yeah, somebody was really fat. Out. Somebody was really, really fat go, and made Gus. this. Super simple. Yeah, all right. Super simple. You see it? Y'all gotta let that thing sit in the refrigerator for overnight, though. That's what? what gotta let it sit in the refrigerator overnight. Yeah, it's gonna hold together a little bit better. Yes, it definitely. Um, Victoria, soon as I use my air fryer, oven, and deep fry and a stove, I'm trying to get away from deep frying stuff. Okay, mm -hmm. I love it. I love it for you. I love it. I love it for you. <laughs> All right, pitch it there. Okay, you got right here. Mm -hmm. And I'm about to practice my egg for you too without my deep fryer. All right, we're gonna let y'all try this. We got what? They feel without the deep without the deep fryer. You can't fry it. Without. You can. It don't come out as fluffy and stuff. Yeah, I said but you, you can't can. fry, but I can. 
Cause I did it in the in the um, iron, the cast iron with way less oil. It came out decent, but not as fluffy and fat as it comes out in the actual like six to eight cups of grease. No, I don't put that much grease in it when I make them. No, no, no. It's all about how the Chinese store happens. Oh yeah, like that. They get so fluffy because of they deep fry them. Call it a Chinese omelet. Bro. There we go. All right, who's gonna try some first? Y'all want to make some sandwiches? Or? I need a waffle iron. I need and to get one actually. Guys too, huh? That's like gonna be a waffle iron. Somebody just mentioned a waffle iron. I need to get a waffle iron. Who was that? Arigay Nelly, how you doing? And Violet Mayan? Violet Amayan? I know I messed your name, but I'm sorry. Yeah, Kimberly yeah. McCray, how you doing, Kimberly yeah. McCray? See y'all people on IG showing up. Glad y'all here with us, IG. YouTube, YouTube. I forget about you, YouTube. We still love you. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Let's go right into it. I gotta see this. I wasn't gonna do that. I was. I'm gonna have it. Mm, 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 mm. Lord Jesus. Here we go. Look at Lord Jesus. Hey, what's up, Bert Taylor? What's going on with you? That sound like a whole mukbang right there. What you hear? <laughs> That's why I can't watch the mukbangs. I'm good. Mm -hmm. Victory something like I always mm. say. Pull up then if you want it. Pull up. All right, you want to try to do it? Hey, y'all do what y'all do. I'm going to get some. Mm -hmm. Antoinette, the Gates of Dipping Sauce. That's raspberry something. Jelly. Raspberry jelly. There you go. Not preserved. Mm -hmm. It's jelly. Wait, so we're not that sophisticated to get preserved? Spreadable fruit. We didn't give y'all your orange. Oh, yeah, so we're commoners, okay. Commoners. Mm. <laughs> well, now you can't hey, get my mind. G, my G. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> when they going to have regular food? Yeah, that sandwich too big for me. That's what grandma's okay. saying. Uh -huh. How you doing, Beverly Riviera? Like okay. You put me one in there. Like, I just wanted a waffle iron so bad looking at that thing now. Get a hold of one, Well, I made that up, but it's a, it's a real thing. Put it up there, Mama. <laughs> you make this up? That sounds mm -hmm. made up to me. Yeah. Mama said, that sounds made up to me. Oh, I got I got like three three um plates under mine. Did you mean to give me three plates back? Here's some more. Here's two more. I'll put the plates out. Okay. Mmm, mmm. That's a lot of food, though. Hold on. I don't even have half. You know me. Mm -hmm. Air fryer Oreos. Air fryer. Push them up a little more. Ooh, oh, Boom, Monte Cristo Day. I don't know why I had to sing it, y'all. <laughs> no, no. That was on your machine? Um, yeah. From Troma. No, okay, anyway. That's good. I mean, you could. I mean, you don't. It's really good. Huh? It's really good. Like, you want me to cut your little piece off? If you like it, Mom. Mmm. 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 Oh yeah, oh yeah, for definite. This is really, really fat. Really and now you got cheese, like, you got like, ham, you yeah. frying bread. It's like a donut. Yeah. <laughs> it's like the fat man. It is donut. like a jelly donut, like a jelly donut ham, ham sandwich. I have a cheese sandwich. Like I, I would eat it. It's just that it's so fat though. <laughs> <laughs> no, not fat. Besides fat, they're like this is fat. Like, you don't need to eat this. This big back food right oh, here. <laughs> this is definitely big back food. Big back food. Victory mm -mm. <laughs> said, Karen, uh, uh, um, Karen, Karen Atkins, baby, my mom, my cousin, she said, that's why it's so good. It's big back food. It's kind of sandwich you should serve at the carnival. This big yeah. back food. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. This is the potato. She said, imagine if it had an egg on top of it. Oh, my God. That's the but you got the sugar, you got the jelly, <laughs> you got the ham, you got the turkey, you got the cheese. This mm -hmm. is some big bad bitch right here. Emily, what happened? Mm. I didn't even see you till now. Mm. 
I think you think we didn't see her, her comment. That's all. This is big back certified. Y'all said we did it. Thank you. Big back certified. I literally, you literally only eat half of these. This is crazy. I'm literally done. I ain't gonna jail. You should not do this on purpose. You ain't gonna jail. Mm-hmm. It's more than thank you. Mmm, but I don't know what to do. Mmm, I don't know. This is ridiculous. So wrong, but so right, right? You should have an age limit on it. <laughs> if you over Sam 40, don't touch it. This is, that's a heart attack sandwich. <laughs> yes. Mm-hmm. It's good, though. I ain't gonna lie. Man. Please read past the fridge. Not the receiving mother. what you deserve. Mm-hmm. And trick you into believing you don't deserve it's it. It's the weirdest thing, but, but it's good. it touched all your senses, though. Mm-hmm. Savory, sweet, crunchy, all of that. Gooey. This is ridiculous. Cheesy. You got the potato bread with this one. Meaty. Mm-hmm. Potato bread got its own taste to it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This is crazy. It's like the, what was that? We go to jail. What about your, like your last supper meal? Right. <laughs> That's what this is. We don't lose everything. Me too, uh, Man, I tell you. You ain't no problem getting tired. Oh, let me taste my my baby's fata. I'm good, so bad. Mm. Yeah, I'm about to make it sure. So you like it or what? Big back certified right here for real. This will work. Mm-hmm. That'll work for you. That's stamp of approval. Big back certified. Because <laughs> right you, you, know, you shouldn't eat this. You should like, not. Mm-mm. See, Andy Carter said, Mama Green said, I can have her sandwich. Come get it. But the contrast is watching you make it, knowing what's in it, mm-hmm. already prejudging it because it sounds weird, and then uh-huh. you bite into it like, yo, this is actually good. It is. Because everything is tingling at the same time. Mm. Hang on, man. You tingling, baby. See, go ahead, baby. Go ahead, baby. Go ahead. See, and say, okay, Daryl, I can tell you wasn't enjoying it. That's good. Mm-hmm. It's different, though, too. They said that would be good for the less fortunate people who would fill them up. They wouldn't even know what the heck it is. Mm-hmm. They wouldn't know what that was. Nope. Man. How do you heat up the leftover sandwiches? I, I was in the oven. Now. In the I oven. Know. I would do it in the oven. I was just thinking that too. If I happen to have leftovers for some dumb reason, um, I but put I them in the broiler. About it, about a beignet, like you can't eat it after it's yeah, off. It's kind of like for now. It's for the same it's kind of like uh like 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 scallops. You eat them when they when they're there. Mm-hmm. That's about a week's worth of juicing eating. <laughs> Am I going to put that in the cookbook? I can. If you guys want that in the next cookbook. I want to even start. This is the day that you feel lonely, sad, and want to pick me up. <laughs> That's what this is. Oh. You need my jelly? Mm-mm. Delicious. Air fryer. Of course, the air fryer crew said air fryer. Okay. How? Oh, Oreo, y'all. Oreo. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I forgot about the Oreo. Look, 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 look. Here you go, babe. Which one you want? I'm grabbing. I don't care. Here's my fried one. I never had fried Oreos. <laughs> Boom. I got your fried Snickers. They're really good. Uh-huh. All right. Oh, I'm making cookie sauce. Mm-hmm. I'm going to do the ice. Oh, it's a little sweet in the sky. I mean, something different. Yeah, I ain't crazy about this. <laughs> it's like a black cake. Nah. That ain't my thing. But it's a hot one. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I need water. Yeah. Or I have like two liters. This is a microphone heated and the toaster oven comes out great. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Toaster, right. oven. toaster oven. We're reheating it? Mm-hmm. Yeah. They said we were naming it Big Back Sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> Big Back Certified for real. <laughs> the whole family raised Mm-mm-mm. Man, mm-hmm. that's what's up. Bloody powder sugar when you eat a donut mm-hmm. with the dag- the actual jelly for the donut with this, mm-hmm. that'd be sacrilegious. You shouldn't eat that on purpose. Like, no. Because you need your lab work done the next day. That's eat too one much. of these. Yeah. That's too much. I'm not eating the whole sandwich. I ate half. I ate half. It's yeah, not eating the whole sandwich. People always. With a Diet Coke. People usually, know. I mean, some people ate the whole thing, but some a bunch of people usually always brought half the sandwich home. Mm-hmm. You would have to. That's a lot. Cause I would judge myself eating that whole sandwich in one sitting. That's a whole lot. Karen said it was her favorite. My cousin Karen said, 
It's my. It was my favorite. Really? Well, Karen, guess what? We got the recipe on our website, so we got you covered, boo boo. Well, I think it's on purpose, though. I might. I don't know. When we get it in the French What's restaurant, it comes with a salad. Okay. Really? It has to. And for everybody that um. Who eat the salad though? It's going to be in the area. Anita and I will be cooking at the Black Diamond Weekend tomorrow. Our event is cooking with AI, with artificial intelligence. It's tomorrow at 9 till about 10, 30, 11, I think, maybe? Um, if you already have tickets to Black Diamond Weekend, of course, that's included. I don't know how much it is, you know, separately. Regular people? Yeah. But we'll be just doing a little... Interaction with artificial intelligence and making a little meal. No, I know he didn't. What? He took a bite of my potatoes and started dancing. <laughs> oh, Lord. I really potatoes. Sandra said, Pop Pop, you be doing too much. <laughs> Sharon, just too much. Look, y'all, that, that was a thing. This was a normal thing. The people was eating in fast food restaurants. I, I call I call uh, again the Fridays. That's fast food. I don't care. Come here, I see that there. Monty Pr Crystal is really good with a pe good peach preserve. I'd, I'd so used a like raspberry that. because that's normally what we had. But these so was, that was a raspberry spread to need a guy, but usually it was the raspberry I preserve. Was a can. It was a blue can. With the, the, uh, no, with the seeds in it. Can. This one doesn't have the seeds. It's seedless that. raspberry. So. Oh, Lord. I got so this much stuff to do. I got so much things to do I for tomorrow. It. We got so much prep to do for you. tomorrow. After this, I gotta I gotta like jam up food. tomorrow. I gotta jam up all the stuff for tomorrow. We gotta get up super early. My yeah. brain was confused the whole time. Eating that I gotta thing. prep everything tonight. They said I was about to say Daryl took a look and closed his eyes. <laughs> yep. So yeah, we love you guys, man. I gotta get to all the work I have to do. I'm gonna be. Probably working half the night just to be prepped for tomorrow and get up first thing in the morning and get that done. But we'll see you at the event. We'll see you at the event tomorrow if you're going to be there. And then for those who can't be there, if they're recording it for television and when it's going to air or if I get information about that, I'll let you guys know. Okie dokie. Smokies. Uh, thank you, Sandra. We love you all. Thank you all for the stars. Thank you, Hattie, for stuff for sending stars. Um, and the and the and the recipes on our website. All right. So we'll see you tomorrow. If we happen to get a chance to go live tomorrow for dinner, which I don't, one hundred percent, I think we will. Um, we'll do our angel eggs tomorrow because Ooh, today is today is angel eggs day. Neither could have knocked that out. All right, so we love you guys, man. I got so much to do, so I'm going to be busy. I will see you guys tomorrow, all right? Hopefully. From my heart to your plates, have a good one.